Hey guys, welcome to the tutorial number 23rd on Curio Control UTM configuration series. This is Saifuddin Ghanizadeh. In this tutorial, I will cover the time ranges submenu and their configuration menu. I will show you guys how to add a new time range, how you edit a time range, and how to delete a time range. Let's start. First of all, open a web browser. Navigate to the Kidio Control Administration panel. Enter the username and password. And click on the login button to login. Scroll down and click on the time ranges menu. By default, Kidio Control will have only one time range by the name of upgrade window. If you want to add a new time range, click on the add button and select create new, specify a name for the time range. You can add a description for the time range. And from the time setting, you can specify that what will be the time range. Do you want it daily or weekly? or absolute. For example, I want it to be daily. What will be the time of the time range? What will be the start time? And what will be the end time? Point to be noted that the time range uses 24 hours for math. So if you are writing, for example, 4 p.m., then you need to write 16 o'clock. And what will be the validity of this time range? Should it be all days, weekends, weekend, or specific selected days? For example, I want the official hours to be from 8 a.m. up to 4 p.m. on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. I want the Friday and Saturday to be weekends. Click the OK button. The time range is created. If you want to edit a specific time range, just select the time range and click on the Edit button. You cannot rename a time range using the Edit, but you can edit the description and other settings. For example, I want to edit the Upgrade window time range. The description is added. Interval for scheduling automatic upgrades. The type is weekly, but there's a problem that it starts from Friday to Saturday. Let me edit this one and change it to daily. And I will select some specific days for the upgrade window. For example, Friday and Saturday. It should start on Friday from 9 a.m. And it should end on Saturday at 4 p.m. Sorry, I should input the 24 hours format. Click on the OK button. And now I have edited the upgrade window time range. If you want to delete a specific time range, just select the time range and click the remove button to remove a specific time range. If you don't know how to use the time range for bandwidth management and content filtering, I have covered them in two different videos and I have put down the link in the description. Don't forget to check out those videos so that you should know the best usage of time range. And that's all for today. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I will catch you very soon with another tutorial. Till then, have nice time.